Hi, this is Harry, and I'm going to explain what you need to bring to your first tutorial. So, you'll need to buy yourself the following equipment. A A4 size, 48 page notebook. A pencil case with the following equipment. Sticky tape, obviously not in a dispenser that large. Red and blue pen. Uh, sharpener, eraser, some highlighters. Pencils, colouring pencils. You've got medium and small post-it notes and a ruler. I'll show you in a moment where to find that document. So when you get into 3029, over here on the left you'll find the link course content. So when you click on that, you'll come over into week one, course introduction. When you click on there, come down to tutorial materials. Within that folder you'll find science interactive notebook. And the first document there is Science Interactive Notebook, first 11 pages. So if you click on that, it should open up into a new window, and this is what the document looks like. So this is the document you'll need to print out on separate pages and bring to the first tutorial. One of the purposes of keeping this notebook is so that you have a keepsake for when you start teaching, so you can show students exactly how you want them to keep their notebook. So if you can be bothered, create yourself a spiffy little cover for your notebook with your name, the title, and also the subject. So they, this title page goes on the front, and on the back is where we'll put our vocabulary. Notice how I turn it upside down, and that brings us to the back. So now we need to start preparing the first 11 pages from those handouts. So grab the first four pages of the document that you printed out, and that's the scope and sequence from the Australian Curriculum Science. So you can see here what I have, I've trimmed the table right down. So on the page where it starts year 5 and goes up to year 10, see the red line there? That's where you're going to cut that table. And then what you're then going to do is glue that over the top so that then you have one continuous document going from foundation year all the way up to year 10. So once you've trimmed down all the handouts, you're ready to set up your first 11 pages. The first job in the Science Interactive Notebook is to number all your pages. So the first page on the right starts with 1, on the left 2, 3, 4, 5 and so on. Go as far as you can go. The very first page will be your table of contents, so you might want to pause the video here and notice the order that I've actually stuck the handouts in. From page 2, you'll see the Australian scope and sequence. So what you have here is an example of flip page. So when the handout is too large, all that we do is we glue in the portion that we can, and then we have a fold-out portion like this. And we have the title there up the top. Notice how I'm using Queensland script throughout. So there's that one. So on pages 3 and 4. On opposite pages you've got the interactive notebook rubric that tells us the standard that we should be achieving at and how to write a self-reflection. Over the page, on opposite pages, you've got the words of wisdom about the AHA Connections visual outline and the opposite page is the AHA Connections visual outline. You should have noticed that I'm, what I'm doing also is using colour throughout and it's not just colour for colour's sake but what I've actually done is color-coded information on the left page here with information on the right page here. So you've got the information in text form and then you've got the information in visual form. Over the page we have the handouts why we keep interactive notebooks in science, the purpose of the left hand and the right hand page, make sure you read that before you come to the first lab. And color-coded once again we've got the information in text form and then over on the other side we've got the information in visual form. So read through that. Then the last page is constructing the AHA Connections page. Once again, it's colour coded, and over on the other page is how to write a connections thesis. So that's the front of the book done. Now flip the book over to the vocabulary section. We're going to be doing four labs throughout this semester. So if you open up to the very first page of the vocabulary section, you're going to write the title of each lab. So we have electricity, then we're going to look at plants and animals, we're going to look at space science, last topic is earth science. After earth science I want you to write the title pedagogy. Now the pages for 
earth science for the vocabulary section, all I've done is I've just cut the corners to make it clear that that section belongs to vocab. And then when we, when we get to this section here, we're going to be writing notes about pedagogy. And that is your interactive notebook for science complete.